Josh Rosenthal, 29 28, four year winner by split decision. Jillian Lionheart DeCourcy. Yeah, I mean, um, it definitely was uh, an awesome way to uh, start off my pro career. Um, you know, Ash is a really tough opponent, and uh, we definitely put on a show. Um, you know, props for her to, for getting in the cage and really just standing and banging and, you know, having just as much heart as I do and um, making it super fun and exciting. Um, I wasn't really expecting to do as much stand-up as I did, um, but I was landing some, some big right hands, so kind of just kept going with it. And then uh, going into the third round, my coach said, hey, the goal for this round is you're going to get it to the ground. So I was like, all right, let me just, <laughs> let me just shoot in, uh, time her punches and shoot in and take it to the ground. Um, and, you know, definitely she did, uh, she did a great job of defending. Um, you know, I was on her back for a good while and uh, she, wasn't, she wasn't lining up, so props to her for that. <laughs> you know, uh, if you guys didn't hear the, my, my post-fight um, interview, uh, today was, uh, marks the day that I had the last conversation with my dad. And uh, we actually spoke about me fighting for Invicta one day and making my pro debut with them. Um, and actually, it, it brought tears to his eyes, and uh, you know he was super proud. So I know he was watching me today, and you know rooting me on and keeping me safe. So um, it, it, it truly feels like a, a dream come true. Um, you know, my walkout song kind of spoke to that. Um, I, I heard that song just in the gym one day. It's not my particular style of music, but it just really spoke to me um, about the experience it, of of just getting here, um, the road it took to get here. Um, I waited a long time. Um, you know, I had other pro offers coming along pretty much the past year, but the only thing I wanted was Invicta. So I just kept kept waiting, kept taking amateur title fights, kept winning titles, and eventually I got that call. Um, so definitely, um, it really feels like a, a dream come true, um, and it feels good to be alive right now. <laughs> What's next for you? What's next is um, I'm gonna. Just kind of, you know, take take my week to relax, recover, um, live life a little bit, um, and get right back to training. I don't really, I'm not somebody that takes a lot of time off. Um, you know, my co coaches kind of forced me to take a week. Um, get right back to training and, you know, look to improve and, and come back even better next time. Um, and just keep winning and, and doing what I got to do. Um, you know, this is definitely the best, the best job to have. <laughs>